Hacks here, coming at you with the first ever recording of the Optic Hybrid. This is my unboxing review. I just pulled it out of the box. I've actually had it before I even went to London, but I didn't have a chance to review it and do some, you know, to, to, to really investigate into what has changed. So right off the bat, we're gonna bring this a little closer, do a little focus. Uh, right off the bat, you're gonna notice that the new controllers that Scuff is releasing have the new texture on the thumbsticks, the same as the new Xbox One controllers are gonna have. Uh, so what's different? What's really different? What has changed? Well, the secret is in the back. This is what has changed. Uh, this time I went with the fully loaded optic scuff because I wanted to make the transition from uh, only using two pedals to fully using all four of them. So my dexterity here never goes away. So I never have to take my thumbs up here unless I'm calling a UAV or something, uh, any kill streak. But aside from that, my to, to make these functions, the main functions, the ones that you use all the time, I'm not going to be doing that. So originally the only thing I had was jump in the back right here and crouch right here and that's only because these are the two functions that are used the most when you are used when you're playing the game x and y are typically obviously reload and cancel reload or swap guns um the reason that we don't we didn't have these originally i didn't have this originally is because we don't really use them as much as we use these two functions but this time i decided to go with the fully loaded one so i can can you know so i can convert to the fully loaded so i never have to do that so uh, this little button, as you're seeing right here, this one, it's clickable. This is a button to program these functions into this. So say you wanted an XY combination here in a, a B on this side or vice versa, uh, you can do that. You press this button plus B button and then you end up putting the third one, which is the one that you want to command it. Another thing that you're going to notice right off the bat is the channel that they have created. And by channel, I mean the grooves that they have put in the back that make the paddles fit right in. If you guys remember on the old scuffs, these used to just be sticking out, which is, which caused a lot of people to, uh, a lot of people to break them because they pull the paddles this way and not straight down. Because once you have your hands on them like this, in focus, once you have your hands on like this, you tend to go this way to push the paddle instead of straight, just up and down. So what they did is that they made these grooves or channels in the in the back of the controller, which uh, fortified the and gave it a lot more support, gave the paddle that much more support. That way you can just pretty much uh, not treat them as 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 hard as you want, but it gives you a little bit more support, so it doesn't it's not. As brave. I mean, I, I honestly didn't see that many breaks, but uh, they, you know, thinking ahead, they did that just in case other people. So let's just say three people had a problem with it. Scuff, you know, being the innovative company that they are, they decided to say, you know what? Since three people have done it, or a couple of people have done it, why don't we just fix the problem altogether so it never becomes a problem? And 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 that's what they did. Another thing that you guys will not be able to tell until you guys hold these in your hand is the fact that they reshaped the handle on this. The contour of all this has been reshaped. And like I said, you won't really be able to feel it until you have it in your hands. Um, but this, my hand fits so perfect. It fits like perfectly. Uh, this has been reshaped so it grips it without you. And I know uh, some people like to play claw and paddle. Uh, the paw, like Merck calls it, this makes it even more comfortable. Uh, before the old one, I used to have a lot of problems with this knuckle bump bump it on this and rubbing up against this uh, and it made it a little bit of a problem but this takes all that away and the comfort level on this guys like I said is is just purely purely amazing um, as I said uh, this you know a, a control like this would not have been put out by scuff gaming just for the sake of putting another product out uh, they're always looking to innovate they're always looking to to better the controls that they have to make it a lot easier for console gamers to be able to uh, perform whether it's first person shooters or, or anything else on the on the market so uh, I will put a little link in the description if you guys want to pre-order these uh, I think that they're gonna start releasing them this month but if you guys want to pre-order an optic scuff uh, please be sure to use the code OPTIC for 5% off. These go really, really fast. Last time uh, when we first announced our partnership with, with Scuff, uh, they were sold out for four weeks in a row because people wanted the OPTIC Scuff. I mean, come on, look at that, neon green. Oh, and now they have the option of doing some really cool LEDs here. 
so yeah, be sure to check that out. And even if you don't want the, the optic scuff and you just want to get an all black stealth uh, uh, scuff, then you can just still use the code optic and you still get 5% off. So yeah, that's going to be that, guys. Uh, I don't know. If you guys have used the four pedals on the back, uh, let me know how hard the transition was. I'm hoping that three days is what it's going to take for me to transition fully to four paddles on the back uh, before it took me right around the same time to do the, the transition from regular controller to paddles. Uh, but yeah, let me know in the description if you guys uh, enjoyed it. Another thing that you guys didn't know, I will be giving away a Optic Scuff Hybrid uh, to a lucky person. All you have to do is put your GT in the comment section, like the video, be sure to like the video, don't forget that, and uh, we will check it out in, let's say, uh, what is today? Today is the 19th, I believe. Thursday, Wednesday, the 17th. So, uh, July 31st, uh, Wednesday. So, two weeks from now, I will announce the winner of this amazing controller. And you guys will do, obviously, the combination that you guys want. Uh, we won't send you this one because this one's mine. And I'm not going to share it with anyone. Uh, but anyway, if you guys have any questions, please be sure to leave them in the comment section. Uh, along with your gamer tag. Like the video. Share it. And we'll go from there. Until next time, guys, as always, this has been the Hacks. I'm out.